Hi folks, it's Pammy from Pammy's Peck of Pursuits. Today we are going to be making a frittata. The girls are giving us some great eggs and so I thought I'd use them up and give us something delicious to have for dinner tonight. To start off with, I'm going to dice a half a dozen potatoes and cook them cook them through ready to mash so we're just going to chop those potatoes up and get them in the pot get them on the stove and get them cooking while we get together the rest of the items we need There we go. We'll get that on the stove. And while that's cooking, got a bit of oil to go in our pan here. And we will be frying up some bacon and some vegetables. So I've got about four or five strips of bacon that I'm just going to dice up and throw in the pan. I like to pull it apart so that it cooks a bit quicker rather than in slabs. There we go. Into the pan it goes. And then we're going to chop up a, about a half of a red capsicum and a medium onion. And you can put whatever vegetables you want in. You can do it with peas and corn and carrots if you want. Whatever vegetables you have on hand, you feel like putting in. Today it's capsicum and onions, and I'll be putting in some turnip greens as well. So we'll just fry off that bacon a bit. And then we're going to add our capsicum and onion. And we're going to throw in a little bit of garlic as well. and some parsley. <coughs> Just keep giving that a bit of a stir, keep that moving in the pan so that the vegetables don't catch. And in the meantime, I'm going to crack eight eggs. and give them a bit of a beat. And we'll just season that with salt and pepper to taste. And then we'll just set that aside for a few minutes while we get the rest of the things ready for our frittata. Still browning those vegetables and bacon in the pan. And this year I didn't have a very good turnip harvest, but I had turnip greens all over the place. So we're having turnip greens today instead of spinach. I picked these the other day and washed them and sliced it up a bit, so I'm just going to give it a bit of a chop. There's 
inundated with greens. But very few actual turnips. But that's all right. You make do with what you get. to let them wilt and pop a lid on and let them just wilt for a few minutes. casserole dish here, just put a little bit of olive oil in the bottom so that our base can get a little bit crispy. I'm going to pour the potatoes in, those nicely cooked potatoes, just soft, and then we're just going to smash them into the bottom of the baking dish. Be nice and crispy on the bottom, like a hash brown base. And then we're going to put our vegetables and bacon on there and just spread that over the potatoes. And in the meantime, I've got the oven heating up to 180 degrees Celsius. And on go the eggs, over, just over the top, pour it over everything. Spread it around, make sure everything gets a bit of egg on it. And then into the oven that goes for about 30 to 35 minutes until it's puffy and lovely and crispy on top. And then we're going to add some grated cheese on top just to give it a nice cheesy crust. And then we're going to pop it back into the oven for another 10 minutes, just until the cheese is all melted and bubbly. So we're going to have our frittata with a bit of a salad, a meager salad, but salad all the same. Got some lettuce that I picked from the garden this morning. And that's been washed and spun. It's nice having lettuce all through the winter. We were able to have lettuce. Just go out and pick a few handfuls every couple of days. And fresh lettuce at all times. <laughs> and then we're just going to have, it's not the season for tomatoes, so I had to buy one. 
but we'll just chop up a tomato and pop it on top of the lettuce. Like I said, a very simple salad, but just some something fresh and crunchy. Got a little bit of salad dressing, balsamic salad dressing, just to give it a bit of taste. And then we're going to pull our frittata out of the oven. Okay, we'll put some salad dressing on your salad too. No, oh, Mark decided to have dinner with me, so. I'll put some dressing on his salad. He's fit, just finished work. I didn't know whether he'd be finished or not. But he is. So he will be joining me for fresh dinner. We'll just cut that frittata. And we're just going to serve that up with our little salad and we've got a lovely dinner. I hope you liked this video, and if you did, I'd love it if I'd give a thumbs up, and a share, and a subscribe, all, all the YouTube stuff. Love to hear from you in the comments below, and um, we'll look forward to seeing you next time around. Thanks so much for watching.